Okay. Both my viewers might have heard you. So what's happening here? I've got three different functions, and I have to find their average rate of change. So this was, you already took a quiz over this. Most of you got everything right, we doing it again. So f of x is written as a rule or an equation, okay? We want to find the average rate of change over this interval. So what are we going to write on our paper? F of 5 minus oops, F of negative 5 over 5 minus negative 5. Is that all right with everybody? Oh, yeah. All right. So here we go. Figure out what F of 5 is. picture what's h of five negative two did you get negative two and then i need h of three is it also negative two So that rate of change is going to be zero. 
And of course, that makes perfectly good sense looking at the picture. What do we have there? A horizontal line. So of course the rate of change is zero. All right, and then finally our chart. So you're gonna set up K of five minus K of negative two over five minus negative two. So K of five is 14. K of negative two is eight.
Okay, 